Hi there, my name is Arjun and here is a weekly horoscope from January 16 to January 22. And this week carries a very turbulent energy. Mm, you want to perform your best but planets are not actually allowing you to perform your best because they are not in so good position. They are in good position but they are not so good position. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see how uh, planets are actually decoding the energy we will be facing in this week okay now this week starts with show off kind of energy you know you want to show your work you want to portray your performance talent in front of people and you will get recognition for that for sure keep doing your work keep doing your tasks keep doing your duties and you will find that you are getting noticed for that that's wonderful and your imagination and creativity will get inclined towards uh, you know arts music designing or any kind of work which you can portray in front of people that will take you know its own existence in others eye that's wonderful and uh, there's a uh, one key word for it appreciation and this word is actually carrying very heavy weight this week you are actually looking for appreciation in this week hmm? at the same time you'll find that uh, when we need appreciation we need appreciation from people so this shows that you are getting inclined towards the public large organizations groups at the same time your thought process your thinking patterns will get inclined towards scientific thinking, logical thinking. That's great. huh? Okay, now let's move further. As we move further in a week around 18th of January, our focus will shift from showing our work to others to doing and performing our tasks in detail. You want to do your work in detail all the minute things you want to perform that but at the same time you want to maintain your calmness emotional calmness but the situations or you can say circumstances are such they'll not allow you to calm down yes your business will take a leap because you are performing very deep and you are performing minutely on each and every task that is good thing but when it comes to relationship yes you will face yes up and down <laughs> that's not an issue uh, it's for a while huh? you have to cope up with it now as we move further uh, you will also rather experience that your mind is totally in another realm you want to maintain your low profile you want to remain isolated and you find you will find that you are getting inclined towards meditation spirituality that is good that is actually good because time actually wants you to connect with yourself for true answers which you are looking for that's great now let's move further now moon actually moves towards libra by the end of this week and when moon comes in libra it's all about dealing, partnership, agreements, signing, uh, signing agreements. And uh, it's all about dealing people. And you, you will find yourself that you are communicating with people on large scale. Right? And you're performing your duties in masses. Yeah? And you're taking active action towards your deeds active action towards your plans that's a good thing that's a good thing now there's another uh, you know energy available sun is in capricorn mars is in aquarius and capricorn and aquarius both the signs are ruled by saturn so oh, we can see that sun and mars are actually performing their duties according to saturn Hmm? So let's discuss Sun in Capricorn. Sun in Capricorn is all about low energy. You may follow a logic which says slow and steady wins the race. Hmm? 
and you'll find that you are doing your work at your best you are performing your duties at your best but something some hindrance is coming and you're not able to show your work to others you are not able to perform for others rather you'll find that you are performing for others but your actions are not generating the kind of results which you want for others in your professional life and at the same time you will get inclined towards your home materialistic comfort which seems a little you know challenging this week yeah now let's move towards Mars Mars is also in Aquarius so Mars says Mars when it comes in Aquarius Saturn says I'm not comfortable with you you have to perform your duties according to me so but Mars is active Mars is all about action determination power Mars keep doing its work towards achieving goal and keep taking active uh, actions but Saturn restricts Mars actions so you will find yourself doubting your own actions am I doing it correctly is it for me but still Mars is doing good in Aquarius you know why because Mars is in conjunction with Venus and Venus is in you know Venus is actually diluting the effect of Saturn on Mars so this is a good thing this is actually a wonderful thing so Venus is all about connecting people it's not about you know uh, creating relationship but rather creating contacts for the welfare of public and you'll find that Venus is all about going towards uh, knowledge and actually romancing with the knowledge which carries scientific approach yeah okay this was uh, actually weekly horoscope from January 16 to January 22 and uh, if you need your own personal charts astrology numerology Feng Shui or tarot reading you can contact me anytime my contact details are given at the end of this video and you'll find that soon I'll be releasing uh, you know offers which you can easily avail and do click my round image on the screen and it'll help you to subscribe my channel yeah i'll see you tomorrow in daily tarot readings till then take care bye bye